If you're driving down the road, and suddenly your car's performance isn't quite what it used to be, your fuel efficiency seems off, and there's a nagging feeling that something might be wrong. Well, one of the culprits could be a malfunctioning oxygen sensor. These small yet crucial components play a significant role in your vehicle's performance. In this video, we'll discuss the signs of a bad oxygen sensor and answer some common questions about it. But before that, welcome to the Four Wheels Empire. Let's get started. Oxygen sensors are responsible for monitoring the level of oxygen in your exhaust gases. This information helps your car's engine control module ECM regulate the air fuel mixture, ensuring optimal combustion. In simple terms, oxygen sensors help your car run efficiently while minimizing harmful emissions. One, per fuel efficiency. If you find yourself filling up the gas tank more often than usual, a faulty oxygen sensor might be to blame. It can lead to an incorrect air fuel mixture, causing your car to burn more fuel. Two, check engine light. The illuminated check engine light on your dashboard could indicate various issues, including a malfunctioning oxygen sensor. Don't ignore this warning. Have your vehicle's diagnostics checked. 3. Rough idling or stalling. A bad oxygen sensor can cause your engine to idle roughly or even stall when you're at a stop. This is due to the improper air fuel mixture affecting engine performance. 4. Difficulty accelerating. If your car struggles to accelerate smoothly, it might be due to a malfunctioning oxygen sensor disrupting the engine's performance. 5. Increased emissions. Failed oxygen sensors can lead to higher emissions. If your vehicle fails in the emissions test or you notice excessive tailpipe smoke, it could be a sign of a problem. 6. Unusual exhaust odor. A malfunctioning oxygen sensor can result in an irregular air fuel mixture, leading to an odd odor coming from your exhaust. 7. Sudden drop in gas mileage. If your car's fuel efficiency takes a sudden dip, you must inspect the health of your oxygen sensors or seek some mechanic assistance as they play a key role in optimizing fuel usage. 8. Sensor codes and diagnostics. Modern vehicles have onboard diagnostic systems that can pinpoint specific issues. If you receive an error code related to the oxygen sensor, such as P0130 or P0135, it's a clear sign that there's a problem. No. You don't necessarily need to replace all oxygen sensors simultaneously. Modern vehicles have multiple oxygen sensors, typically one or two upstream before the catalytic converter and one downstream after the catalytic converter. If a sensor fails, you can replace the specific faulty one. The lifespan of an oxygen sensor varies, but on average, it lasts around 50,000 to 100,000 miles 80,000 to 160,000 kilometers. In conclusion, paying attention to the signs of a bad oxygen sensor can save you from decreased fuel efficiency, increased emissions, and potential damage to other components. If you notice symptoms like poor performance or a lit check engine light, it's a good idea to have your oxygen sensors inspected. Regular maintenance and prompt replacements when needed will keep your car running smoothly and environmentally friendly thanks for watching if you found this video helpful be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more car maintenance tips and tutorials have any questions or topics you'd like us to cover drop them in the comments below until next time drive safe